guys, welcome back. So as you can see from the title today, I'm going to be doing a smoky eyed, brown smoky eyed look. So if you would like to see how this look turned out right here, then just keep on watching. Okay ladies, start off with, as usual, just apply some sellotape from the edge of my eye to the end of my brow. I'm taking this L'Oreal um, eyeshadow primer. So just apply that all over the eye area. Take it up to the brow bone. So it is quite a thick product, so I'm just going to be sculpting at the bottom of my eyebrow. And then just leave that there, and then you just need to smudge it out. Taking your finger as usual and warm the product up and then it just starts to melt. So just get the primer on the eyes. We're we'll using this Sharon Osborne matte palette and this is in Duchess Quad and it's got the eyeshadow Sweet Eyes, Sexy Eyes, Femme Fatal and Embark. Just taking this brown colour right here, a blending brush and just apply that into the crease. and just bring it downwards so whatever product you have left just blend it downwards as me mentioned earlier we are going to go for a really brown smoky eyed look so just taking the colour and bark just going to be applying that with a flat brush into the outer part of the eyelid first so and this is a matte shade so firstly we're going to start by applying it into the outer V ok, so just apply it into the outer V start dragging it forward gone and applied it all over the lid area and don't worry about the harsh lines because you're just gonna blend them out getting the highlighter shade in there just gonna be highlighting under the brow bone area a large fluffy brush I'm using my Sigma E35 we're just going to be building that colour up so really intensifying it now and then taking it into the crease apply that highlighter colour into the inner corner any black eyeliner of your choice, I'm using the Affinity Illamasqua Gel Eyeliner. Click my E05 brush. Okay, and then just line your upper lash line. But you see how I'm just doing it halfway? Moisturiser, I'm just using this Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturiser, I'm just going to be applying that all over my face. I'm using the Benefit Professional. Apply that over the face. Blend that in. Wasn't really feeling this product first, but I've just 
because I bought the beauty score that you ladies did see in my last haul video just really liking this and something is really breaking me out but I do not know what it is but so far this has worked really well so just apply that massage into the face apply that all over the face area today I'm going to be using this one by Chi Chi and this is the fabulous and flawless foundation in number 9 golden flat top kabuki in 928 by Sedona lace I'm just taking this and applying it over the face so I'm just kind of patting it in first and then working it in circular motions This is the first time I'm using this foundation as well and I must say it's really nice coverage. And then just blend it out to the hairline. On the word, while we're on the word of Chi Chi, I'm just going to be using the three in one eye concealer in the color tanned. There's that one there. So I've never used this before either. So just <coughs> apply it under my eye area. supposed to be a brightener, concealer and a highlighter all in one. So we shall see how we get on with that. And then just blend that in. Mm, loving this concealer. everything I'm just going to use this MAC prep and prime in CA3 transparent finishing powder tapered face F25 just going to be applying that under the eye area and then just work it in I'm really loving this for setting powder as well. I believe they do have these in different colours, if I am right. So just apply it down your T zone area. I'll stay matte in 005 just to set the rest of the face with a large Real Techniques powder brush. In the sleek contour kit in medium 05 contour brush. I'm just going to use this to contour under the jaw. And this brush does give you a really good angle. Colors of the cheeks. Do 
the forehead. And then the side of the nose. Real Glass Radiant Magento Blush and the Real Techniques Expert Face Brush. I'm just going to be using that for the Anastasia Dip Brow Palmade in Dark Brown Eyebrow Routine. So just give them a good comb out with a spoolie. Ladies, this product is amazing. Watch these eyebrows just transform. that beautiful eyebrow love it the way it comes out it's just beautiful I do highly recommend for you ladies to check this product out if you already haven't because it is definitely one not to miss out really easy and simple to work with so then just so then just get your spoolie and comb out the front hairs look too fake I love this product so much ladies love 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 it I've actually got my sister hooked to this product now and my cousins and they love it tried it on clients so I'm just gonna get a couple more colors of these as well so I will leave obviously list everything down below you can check it out the black coal pencil to do the waterline. Okay, then for highlighter, I'm going to go with this um, Kiko eyeshadow in 208. So the MAC Whisper of Guilt um, dupe apparently and I have ordered the MAC Whisper of Guilt so stupid but I <laughs> just wanted it in my collection so just apply that to highlight brush from before, blend it out so just give it a good blend just taking a MAC pencil brush and the same brown embarked colour just going to be applying that into the outer edge just to kind of darken it a bit and take it into the crease so just kind of see how it's just darkened it a lot more ending brush and just kind of blend them the harsh lines out And apply any mascara of your choice. I'm choosing this one by Benefit.
Uh, lastly, onto the lips. Go ahead and use this Maleficent MAC True Loves Kiss. the Maleficent one. Go ahead and apply that. Do you have the final look ladies? Please hope you have enjoyed this brown smoky eyed look and also the full face tutorial as well. Do let me know in the comments down below and also giving this video a thumbs up if you do like me doing a whole face routine so not skipping out any of the parts just kind of throwing it all in there and just showing you from to finish. Do let me know down below and also I hope you have enjoyed the way this look right here has turned out because I think it's such a gorgeous um, smoky eyed a uh, brown smoky eyed look and it's very wearable and I do really like it I think it's such a nice look and this palette was just divine love it ladies love 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 it really digging my browns these days so just love the way I've never really done a nice smoky brown look before so yeah I just had fun creating it for you ladies and the uh, red lip just completed it off really well so I hope you've enjoyed the way this tutorial has turned out don't forget to check out my birthday giveaway that is currently running to win all those amazing goodies and also do hit the thumbs up button and also subscribe and I shall see you ladies on my next video lots of love bye